Today we got some po' boy cooking. I'm going to cook up some chicken empanadas real quick, real simple, and bring your beer as always. Let's get started. All right, so basically all you're going to need is you're going to need one rotisserie chicken, and it's already done, and make sure it's just rotisserie chicken, not the lemon crap from Walmart, and make sure it's nice and juicy. You're going to need some uh, chipotle seasoning, or you can make your own. We're going to need some fajita seasoning mix. You're going to need some pie crust. And you're going to need some Colby Monteri Jack cheese. All right, so welcome back. Now, what I'm going to tell you is pretty simple. And even if you're drunk, you can do this. But you want to take your chicken and you want to debone it all, if you know what I'm saying. And you want to have it simply just like this. And then you want to have it nice and nice. <laughs> so you want to have that. And you want to have it. So off the bone, pull it apart. So basically pull it, and you grab two forks, put them, bam, 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 you got it. All right, put it back into the bowl. Now, what you're gonna do, you're gonna place your chicken into a bowl, just like now. Try and get it open. All right. You're gonna take 1.4 ounce of your fajita seasoning, sprinkle it in there. Take half a cup of water. Again. Uh huh. Uh huh. Uh huh. <laughs> 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 I think it's why your eyes roll in the back of your head. <laughs> All right. Right, now you want to take your cheese and you want to grab a big handful and throw it in there. Now you're going to take all this and you're going to mix it together. Make it nice. If you know what I'm saying, this is going to sound like something else. Kind of get that sound going like mac and cheese stirring you know what I'm saying <laughs> okay now you got your bowl and you want to go ahead and turn that nuki thing on yes this you're gonna nuke it for one minute right, so now you want to take it out of your microwave And our cheese has melted. Now you want to mix it a little bit more. Get that squishy sound going. And if you need to add more cheese, go ahead. But I think this is plenty. And now you want to take one fourth of that Chipotle seasoning and dab it in there. Just a little bit of water. That'd be all right, so now it's time to go ahead and get it mixed all around. Pie. You'll take your pie crust, roll it out a little bit. We're gonna do about, not even, maybe, let's just say half a plate, and we're gonna cut it in half. A butter knife, and you'll go ahead and just go across the plate. Get a clean cut. Now you want to take a little pinch of your chicken, about that much as needed, and we're going to squinch it all together. Fold it like this, then fold it like that, make kind of a little burrito out of it, okay? Then get everything nice and tucked in, mold it together, and then bam, we got one empanada. Now it's time to take your stuff and put it into your oil. And after a few minutes, it's gonna start turning golden brown on you. You wanna flip it over. And now, after a couple more minutes, we're gonna take this bad boy off. You're gonna have a nice golden brown. Look at that. Mm. 
place on your plate. If you got some napkins, go ahead and put it on your napkins. There's your dish. Pretty cheap meal. We not even spent $15. You definitely make more. Um, I'll post in the link in the description what all you're going to need, pie crust and all that. Of course, you're going to need beer to get started. But we made our empanadas. They only fry up for just a few minutes. If you got an actual big deep fryer, this will be an entree to surprise your friends at your Super Bowl, whatever it be. Make sure you hit that like button. Follow me on Pinterest and you'll see the recipe there. We got the po' boy board right there for you. Easy recipes. And as always, I'll see you in the next video. I'll catch you later.